I'm waiting for this splitter to keep dying, but until then. Will we see the wanted poster? Or will we get uh what's her face? Into the woods. We finally made it. I think I've got to do it at least once. We've reached our destination. Are there giant monsters in both of those places? <clears throat> the the mantis I think was 46. So as I approach like mid 40s I should consider it. Stay sharp. We're going in. Well, we've seen forest ropers at the arena. Some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. Right then. in the demo. But there weren't any of the, the shell things. There were shells. You pick the wrong fight. Now, take this. Here I go. 
That tornado. We can really make weapons with this. You know, early in the game, it made sense that they said stuff like that because they want to really draw. The reason the trees it. around here are so big is because of astral energy, right? It's possible, but give them enough time, and trees can get pretty big on their own without any extra help. Well, I'm, I'm really getting to. It goes towards the game is like way too hyper explainy. And the dialogue's supposed to be varied over time. But a form like this should be easy. It's over. I never it's one of those Fridays where you just end up getting started too late and you just say, screw this. Here I come! What are you doing, Robert? Take this! It's over! You're not taking it! Got Dragon Swarm! What's up, Will? Wow, that was a nice move there. I know, right? That you couldn't do. Don't give him a challenge. Let's go with top of it. So it's a grab here, thrust the left leg, then use the right arm to leverage over. Stop memorizing my move! That was in the demo. I'm just gonna keep calling out things that I remember from the demo. As they like finally appear. Breakfast in the door is nice. It's alright, Will, it's a JRPG. The battle scene is just combat and don't even worry about it. The problem is that my splitter is dying. It feels like every like few minutes I'm just like looking over at the capture. You sure showed them. Because I can see All the capture. Day's work. I know, right? Well, Will, you did post that other thing today, so you, you, a couple of days ago. So there's questions as to whether or not you know what art is. It's a legitimate concern after that auto tune. Get in, get out! Be careful, everyone! This one isn't normal! I've got flyers! I've got it! a very strange definition of beauty, sir. You're mine! You're mine! You're mine! I got it! You're mine! You're mine! You're mine! Watch this! Dragon Four! Look sharp! Lightning It keeps fading out like this. I might actually double check if I have unstoppable. another splitter. And then I'll be very sad when that splitter isn't as good. That's the phrase I'm going to use. Cash. Fighting for. Oh no. Man, I'm famished. I have to look into what my guy kingdom is. I'm gonna go up or down? Hi. Get through all this and then not be great in the Mega Man Relay qualifiers. And then see if there's still a desire to actually have some sort of Game Boy Relay submission. Where apparently somebody said, hey, Cav, you want to play one? Uh, I can't believe you're asking me that. Consider yourself finished. There's like probably 20 people better than me. You know what I mean. But whatever. Looks like it could be worth something. Ooh. 
Is there a new one that we were kind of looking at? Oh. Eh. Growing boy. Yeah, that's an actual move. both ladders up. I was kind of hoping the map would just immediately Careful. connect. We don't want to fall here. Yeah, I doubt anyone would hear if we even called for help. I don't think people flattened into pancakes can call for help. When characters decide they want to like turn, like so what they think is a better angle. No, I want the attack to go this way. It'll hit all four enemies, and then they're like, "Nope, no, we're gonna turn slightly off and only hit one or two of them." This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Water! Here My turn! Call. I'm on! Yeah. It's Get over! <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. This looks nice and tough. This is my problem with like building the meter all the way up to five. Whew, what a rush. It's like you, you, you can't use it. I went the way with the dead end of the treasure chest first. Hey, look, there's the beginning of the area across this imp completely impassable chasm. Inner level. Now it says inner level. Up a level, down a level. Hi, Hoodle! Now I see what I can do! Where are you going? You're on! You're mine! It's time! Go to the ground! Mega Red! You're mine! Try it, Joker! You're mine! Now! River! Astral Energy! Say no more! Big time, but when there's more than one enemy, I'd rather just take it out. Be still! Lunar Rondo! Say no more. Okay, the other one's down. Good. There's more where that came from. Not that I remember enough of how Final Fantasy VII worked out, but I. I feel like I'm act I'm personally attacking fewer enemies than I did in seven. For the remake. Hi, Goes down the path of saying I have more useful party. Did you 
just kill me? Yes, I need you, remember? What? This one's mine! I'm not good! Here I come! That's good! We did it! We did it! We got it! We turned the tables on! There are still more left! Right! No time to hold back! Punch it! I can punch the armor, he says, as he punches the enemy. We did it! These little ones are hardly worth our time. Let's die again. I feel stronger. I mean, a bit. Good. We're counting on you, Rinwell. On me? Well, I'll do my best. Yeah, and it, it died on the main monitor again. Since uh, that last one. I don't want to pause the stream just to rewire everything, but we're getting there. And honestly, if anybody has recommendations for HDMI splitters, I'm listening. Otherwise, I'm just going to Amazon and saying, alright, let's well, top one, let's go. Here I come! Here I come! You're done! Really quiet right now, so this Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Wish they were all that easy. Yeah, I think we might be getting too strong. Isn't that good? Play along, would you? Seriously. That I did turn the difficulty up, so whenever I see like see them do a lot of damage back to me. Well, yeah. Something you wanted to say? I'll smash you! I'm just Blade getting started. You're mine! You're finished! Let me start! Blade 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 Blade. I can feel my precision improving. Hmm. X-Ray, do I need to crank the video quality? I'm trying to figure out if that was just me watching it last night that looked bad, or if it actually does need a higher bit rate. Go no further! Alright. Right. A lot. Can I do that while streaming? It just does anything. Looks better. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. Probably still go higher though. Like we're gonna lose to small fry. Was this? Yeah, this is worth getting. Should this really be here? No. Star over there now. Right, here we go. It was like 1300. The people talk about like 8 bit games and what stream quality do you really need? 
and then we can actually follow the options. Now we're playing something in HD. Can you take care of that? Now it's up to 2000. Now you see what I can do. It's over. Your power. I'm not trying to be dramatic with it. So, it's a part of it. Embrace it. I guess you had your uses now and again. I told you, it's my son. I'll crush you. Lightning reflexes. Ten of us. Yeah. I think we're about to be real lucky. Another opal. I found some equipment. Let me take a look at it. <laughs> and so yeah, easy enough to just crank it up. Everywhere you look, it's nothing but green, green, and more green. Just like Calaglia. Rocks, rocks, and... That static was from the splitter, not from the game. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! See you continue on in that thing. Uh, yes, my lady? Something you wanted to say? I'm about to actually go and see if I have another spear. I can feel my power growing. Levels. It's kind of hard because of like the artistic effect of that green in her armor, like, it almost makes it look like it's just still fuzzy. Judging by the stench, I'd think... Well, it's a different one. You're all grown now! doing here and also why is this stand like completely off now this microphone's at it all in a good position and worry about making other adjustments later Kind of her stick, so I need that. So I just need cash. Flatfish are really expensive, and that's kind of weird. Manage ranch, nice. I can actually get stuff from here.
It's kind of tempting right now, honestly. I'm impressed how well balanced this thing is. Let's uh, save the video game. Let's see what. See, is this demo boss? Or is this somebody else? The cat is what ran us down here. I have to remember that. So we have no idea what's here. So is that a branch or is it's that something crazy. like. I've never seen anything like these plants before. It's like they're an invasive well, species. Like... Not that I'm surprised. Calaglia is all dry and Cislodia oh, Watch out! The hell? Is that a Zoogle? That thing is huge! Everyone, be careful! Zacharinia. Ah, why can't these dumb plants just keep to themselves? Less whining and more fighting, thanks! Yeah, yeah, I got you. Watch it. The enemy is over there. Does that move have an element? I'm targeting the tentacles, but not it. Damn it! I can't get close enough to hit the main body! Let's start by taking out the tentacles! Here I come! Watch oh, this! Uh, 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 ignite! Uh, Take this! I'm in the wheel! It's over! Air thrust! Walk uh, like uh, Healing circle! Here you go! No, we turned the you tables like on it! There are the, still more left! Right. Right. No time to hold back! Uh, into the middle of everything. There, we got him on the run. So those are the damn astral Right. Still anyone Something fight. you want to say? Not so long as you keep them pointed toward the enemy. I'll heal you all. Take this. Anything in the way I am. Take this. I never miss. Now escape. Now escape. We didn't even have to strike it. You're finished. You're mine. You're finished. Here's the evil! Dance 
You know, the other side of this is we don't know who sent the cat to send us here, so maybe that was some other lord and we Everyone just blew okay? up the spirit vessel. I'm starting to get that it's a trap feeling again, guys. We'll just pray you're wrong. Hey, there's that cat. Looks like it's not done leading us yet. Oh, that's Sephiroth's cat, isn't it? What? They've really got us on the ropes. Don't forget to heal your wounds. What's up, infamous Red Yoshi? God damn it, Alvin. I don't think Alvin's here. Should we really be lighting a campfire in the middle of a forest? She's got a you point. You scared of starting a fire? As long as we put it out thoroughly afterwards, we'll be fine. Really, it's a good thing to have a fire here. It'll keep the Zoogles away. Have you both forgotten what we've come out here to do? I'll let them relax, Shion. It's good to unwind every now and again. <sighs> if you say so. Beef Stew is the XP booster and everything else, so they changed that. Rinwell, mind if we chat a little? Hoodle, come here, sweetie. Woo! Good boy. What are you doing? Uh, it's flying practice. Hoodle doesn't really like to leave my side, but if I don't make him spread those wings every now and then, they'll start to weaken. It's important he practices. Also, I'm pretty sure he put on some extra weight. Oh. Must be the food we're making. Probably because everyone keeps sneaking him snacks when you're not looking. I knew it! I thought there was something fishy going on. Oh, it's really not good for birds to be overweight, you know? Oh, really? Ah, uh, I'm sorry, Rinwell. You were feeding him too? You haven't been giving him anything he can't eat, have you? I'm pretty sure everything I've given him has been okay. Just to be sure, though, why don't you tell me what he can't eat? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. Is something the matter? No, no, not at all. It's just, for a really long time, Poodle was the only friend I had. So, on the one hand, it makes me really happy to see everyone be so accepting. But, on the other, it's a bit of an adjustment sharing him, you know? Every one of us can see that he's like family to you. I can promise no one's trying to ignore your feelings or anything. Yeah, I'm sure you're right. I'll talk to the others about it later. We should really get some rest. Burn the forest to the ground. No. Another day, ground, another gold. Oh, well, is this the other? Those are the same stones from the quarry. Apparently, everyone's using these apple gels. I guess it's good that they're using them. This had better not all be for nothing. Somehow I doubt it'll be a wasted trip. Really? Whatever you say, I guess. Let's follow. Good luck on the Jow fight. Have a good day at work. Dun, dun, dun. You know, for a guard, you're not too good at tailing people. That's a brag, but 
This kind of thing is my specialty. So it really is you. When Law told us, I almost didn't believe it. I'm just surprised you could do two things at once, Law. What's that supposed to mean? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no. Whoa, whoa, it looks whoa. like somebody needs to be put in their place. The one time I wanted to resolve things peacefully. What the hell? I thought you wanted a police. You'll never make me talk. Not helpful. In fact, you're pretty damn stubborn, you know that? Here I go. I'll you have a shield. You. Now we see the attack completely in a circle around her, not actually hitting her at all. Did you just kill me? Yes. I need you, remember? Nice. Who's actually break through whatever over she was trying to use? Speaking of apple gels, someone else is in apple gel. I'm gonna need more. Poisoner. Better be this effective when you join the party. Tiger Blade.
They're not playing around. No. Now! No. Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! She have so many ridiculous hit points there so that this would end it halfway. What's your deal, huh? Did Doalim put you up to this? You send us away and then come to finish us off? I don't buy it. I wonder. We came here following a black cat. What reason could you have for tagging along? Certainly not as a spy. You think she might have business with whoever called us out here? Ooh. And even if she did... I highly doubt she was trying to keep us from harm. Am I wrong? Just who was it that led us out here? Answer me. Are you serious? <laughs> Hold your horses. I'm the one who summoned you all here. Well, maybe not all. Nice of you to drop by, Kisara. It's been a while. You two know each other? How many people can be someone's Hello, dad? Brother. Oh, it's a brother. So, you're the big heroes who liberated Calaglia and Cislodia, huh? It's an honor to meet you all. We didn't do it all on our own. We had a lot of support from others along the way. I like how all of a sudden they're trusting. <laughs> so, wait, Kisara's your sister? Yep, that she is. The only family I have left. She was the dreamer of the two of us. Full of hope for the future of this realm. For both Danans and Renans alike. For siblings, you two don't exactly look like you're on the best of terms. That's because Migal here is a traitor. Isn't that right? <laughs> we were in the guard together. That is, until he was caught plotting to assassinate His Excellency Lord Dohalim. He took off after that. Is that true? You're so happy. You still believe that's what happened? I don't see why I shouldn't. Even if the truth slapped you in the face, you'd reject it. Same as back then. Heck, even now I'm still working to serve Lord Dohalim. More lies. You haven't changed. Before Lord Dohalim came to power, this country was ruled by an oppressive regime. We lost both of our parents to it. Back in those days, there were countless Danon children who had been orphaned by the Renan's tyranny, just like us. So we formed our own families among ourselves and helped each other out, surviving as best we could. And then Lord Dohalim came along. He abolished the oppression that kept us down, and the Danans were treated like people again. Menencia was reborn under his watch, and orphaned children became a thing of the past. If so, then why did you betray him? I'm not done talking. <laughs> I'm sure you know the Renans are trying to harvest astral energy from us Danans. Yes, Shion here told me that's how they decide their next sovereign. That's right. There are five types of astral energy. Earth, water, fire, wind, and light. All of them are contained Six. within every living sure. being. And that's the excuse they use to enslave us. You ever wondered what happens to living beings and other matter when they lose all their astral energy? What about heart? They just die, or so I thought. If only. Oh, was that See what the for Zulu was? What the... is that... is that... metal? Not metal, but to be honest, your guess is as good as mine. I believe it's... nothing. Matter with no physical form. 
Just a reminder of what was it, once there. It looks there. like a hand. They call it the hollowing. The hollowing? The process itself is invisible to the naked eye, but it makes the impacted area reflective. Once it consumes my whole body, that's it for me. I'm dead. What? what? That can't... Miguel, when were you going to... A sinister plot is unfolding as we speak. One Lord Dohalim is likely none the wiser to. It was blind luck I even found out about it. I tried to warn the man for all the good it did. Take a look at this. It's called the Fruit of Helgen. When a Danon eats this fruit, their body enters a heightened state, one that causes them to emit more astral energy than usual. Hold on. Could this be the reason Alfin and Lau were feeling out of sorts last night after we ate with Dohalim? Sounds like you've been introduced to these things before. None too surprising, either. Most of the realm's food supply contains traces of the fruit. If that's what we ate, does that mean we'll gummies. become hollowed like your hand? You don't need to worry. You'd have to consume a large amount of the fruit regularly to exhibit any symptoms. But if that's the case, then why aren't I showing any symptoms? Why would you be inflicted and not me? If I had to guess, because the guards' meals are free of it. Otherwise, they'd risk Lord Dohalim noticing. I tried to warn him, but all it got me was locked up. They force-fed me the fruit the entire time I was in chains. It's a miracle I made it out. They eventually left me for dead, thinking I would succumb to my condition. But I survived and managed to escape. So the assassination plot. Just a cover-up? What? Eventually, I found others like me. And together, we founded the Gold Dust Cats. Where did you come from? Oh, you're over there. Our mission is to uncover the truth and warn Lord Dohalim. As you can see, though, we haven't gotten very far in that regard. But I'm hoping that's about to change now you're here. Which is all thanks to your faithful feline servant. It was a shot in the dark, but fortunately you recognized her for what she was, and Zara accomplished her mission with flying colors. Who's our good kitty? So what's our plan of attack, boss? One of the Lord's routine inspections of the city. It's the only time commoners can talk to him face to face. That's the idea, anyway. His security is bound to be on high alert, but with you lot along, it's the best chance we're going to get to approach him. All right, we're in. But I have to know, how do you keep going with all you've been through? How have you not given up hope? Hey, someone has to fight for the future of the Danans here. The future? Lord Doholi may be a wonderful person, but in the end, He's still a lord like any other. And lords can be replaced. Once the yeah. current contest is over, the next lord of Elba Menencia will take over. Then it'll be back to square one for all of us. About time somebody said that. That's why it's imperative Lord Dohalim sees the light. You really believe Dohalim is going to stick his neck out for a Danon like you? Is it so impossible to imagine? Everything begins with a simple leap of faith. She looks like she's like a robot or something. I don't know. Hmm?
Take your stuff. Okay. Huh? Uh-huh. Can't sleep. And you? I woke up randomly and couldn't fall back asleep. I'll go back to bed once I get tired again. How's your shoulder? Huh? My shoulder? Oh, you mean where Dohalim smacked me? It feels a little off, but... Ah, it's fine. I'll manage. Doesn't look like it's gotten much better. I'll give you some more healing. That should do the trick. Hey, yeah, you're right. That feels much better. Thanks, Xion. I thought you couldn't feel pain. I've been thinking about what happened, and I was out of line. I know it takes more than a couple of bullets to bring down a lord. Forget about it. It's fine now. We all got out of there safe, and now you've healed me up too. We're going to take down all the lords. That was the promise we made, right? Yeah, I guess. But there was one other thing I wanted to ask you. Back at the palace, Law said you took that hit because you were worried about me. What was it you were worried about? That's... kind of hard to explain. Just tell me. Well, for one, if we lost you, I wouldn't be able to use the Blazing Sword anymore. Obviously. <laughs> But more important than that, I guess I just couldn't let you die. Honestly, I think that's all there is to it. There you go saying stuff like that again. You never learn, do you? But... He's gonna walk out. Well, oh, he's gonna turn around. Anyway, it's necessary so we can fulfill our promise, right? R right. Glad you remember that much. 
Are you okay? Your eyebrows always look angry. <sighs> anyway, I think I'm gonna go to bed. Sleep well. What am I doing? I actually want to know if that cutscene is the same or if that's dependent on affinities. I sent Kisara back to town under the cover of night. You do realize that she was searching for you all this time, right? I wonder why. She never could let things go, ever since we were kids. Maybe she was keeping an eye on you all because she thought you might cause trouble. I wouldn't be surprised. Do we need to be worried about her? She could easily report us. Even if we could have kept her here, it would have just raised more suspicion. Besides, I want to believe in her. More leaps of faith, huh? <laughs> Once we make our move, I'll send Zare to come fetch you again. Until then, stay close and try not to wander off too far. Guess we're waiting on word from Magal for the time being. Let's go out somewhere then. Twiddling my thumbs isn't my style. I'm going with you if you are. If I let you people go unsupervised, you'd probably wind up too far out for Magal's news to reach. Oh, come on. We're not children. <sighs> How about you make like the rest of the city and play nice for once? I know he said it's necessary, but... Are we sure Magal's plan is a good idea? I mean... Just because we came expecting a fight doesn't mean we have to have one. If Magal is right about Dohalim, we may have no reason to fight. Dohalim may have found a way to build a future where Danans and Renans can live alongside each other in peace. Yeah, I guess that may be true, but I'm still not sure about this. I just can't bring myself to trust a Renan. I really don't understand what's going through Magal's head. And as for him and Kisara... He said they were siblings, right? But things seem kind of awkward between them. I was an only child, so I never had to deal with that kind of stuff. Is their situation really that different from ours? That's... I mean, I guess not, but... The reality is that we don't know what's true and what isn't about Menencia yet. Until we know that for sure, Let's not pass judgment one way or another, okay? Yeah, okay. That's fair enough, I guess. So, let me ask you something, Rinwa. Hoodle and Megal's cat are both animals native to Dana, right? Right. And Zoogles definitely aren't. Well, duh. Those things are too hideous to be from here. Not that owls are any better. Hmm? Ah, ow! Ow! I take it back! I love owls! Owls are the best! I swear! Hoodle's pretty cute, I'll admit. But I've also been rather partial to cats, too. What about you, Xion? Huh? Who? Me? I... Uh... Well, I guess... I like them both. <laughs> hmm? Nothing. I didn't say anything. Either way, the more I think about it, I've never heard of anyone keeping Zoogles as pets. Is it because Renans only use them for practical purposes? Yeah, that could be the reason. They were originally created to serve as beasts of burden, so to speak. Hey, can you guys quit standing around and get him to leave me alone? I'm begging you! <laughs> <laughs> We're not just kids.
ever have somebody at everyone a channel with like two people in it? should be all grown up by now. All right. Right. The big plan is to talk to him. Always good to be back in familiar territory. Still going. Oh, good. There you are. You people again. You shouldn't be loitering around here. Don't force me to arrest you. Think we've established you couldn't even if you wanted to. No. Oh. What? Law, quit it. We're not here to argue with you, Captain. We've got something to deliver to you. Here. Uh, that's... That bracelet. Is that my brother's? Why are you giving this to me? I can't help but wonder what my brother is planning with all this. I'm not sure. That said, I think he was being sincere about everything he told us back there. I've met a lot of good people fighting to liberate Dana. And I got the same feeling from Egal that I did from all of them. I think we can trust him. I think you're a good person, too. Otherwise, you would report on us and the Gold Dust Cats, right? What makes you think I won't? Because Migal trusts you. And that's enough for me to trust you, too. You're a pretty unusual guy, Alfin. Do you go around acting like that everywhere you liberate people? What do you mean? Sorry, forget it. It's nothing. Okay. Anyway, I think we'll find out more about what Migal's planning soon enough. All we can do now is wait and see what happens. I guess so. Hmm. I guess we just wait for things to kick off. Yeah. Looks like we'll be staying at the inn another night.
loading. Oh, it's Zare. Hold on. She's got something tied to her collar. Oh, she left. It happens tomorrow. They want us to meet in that underground quarry. Say it louder. Then we should prepare while we still can. We'll spend the night here at the inn again. Well, this is it. Yeah. What angle is the Lord gonna take? That depends on Megala. Let's hurry to the quarry. Finally. If only we could have flown with the wind to get here faster. This quarry. Next petition, step forward. My lord, please hear my humble request. Who goes there? Halt. Hmm. Is that McCall? The traitor? Guards! Don't let them get any it's closer! Him. His Excellency's life is in grave danger! Kill them all at once! Wait! Stay back, Your Excellency! It's too dangerous! Who is this guy? Enough. He cannot harm me. Nor, I think, does he intend to do so. Isn't that right, Miguel? Indeed it is, Lord Doalim. I have heard many a rumor about you, but I suppose we'll have more time for those later. You have made some rather interesting friends. He has something he wishes to show you. We are here to make sure he does. And what could that be? Please, my lord, you needn't give these miscreants the time of day. I <laughs> shall personally... Silence, Kelzalik. I Look wish to top, speak Kelsalik. with them. Please, you were saying. It's what's in there, my lord. Oh, that's weird. Have you ever walked all the way through the quarry, my liege? Right to the other side? Now that you mention it, I don't believe I have. It's a den and medical facility of some kind, is it not? I think you need to see for yourself, my lord. All I ask is that you witness this before you pass judgment upon me. Then witness it I shall, Kisara. This man is your brother, correct? I would like to ask that you personally escort me while in there. We're not going to keep an eye on Lord McTraderface? Vassal? The Vizier, the Grand Vizier. Just dropping rocks into it. I should warn you, what lies ahead is fraught with danger. You should all take care and stay on your guard as we proceed. Danger? What could be so dangerous about it? It's a regular workplace, isn't it? 
You'll see. Please, I ask only that you trust me. Sounds like you all need to rethink your medical facilities around here. Hospitals are supposed to be safe. Quite. Kisara, let's see what they have to show us, shall we? As you wish, my lord. Your strength is appreciated. With you, we can all breathe a little easier. <laughs> Don't even dodge. I didn't realize you held my strength in such high regard. I meant what I said before. Anyone who tries to fight you will have a hard time of it. How long have you been wielding that enormous shield? Ever since my first job as a guardsman. Our duty was to stop any attack dead in its tracks, then take all that momentum and turn it right around to smash the attacker. But why bother blocking in the first place? Wouldn't it be better to just dodge the attack and hit back immediately? Try doing that when you've got someone standing behind you that you need to protect. This shield is a symbol of our conviction as guardsmen. Every time we successfully block an attack, our fighting spirit only grows stronger. So what you're saying is that, unlike Law, you can actually take a hit. I'm right here! <laughs> This area right here is where the real heart of darkness used to lie in Menencia. It wasn't unusual for the holes we dug in this earth to become our graves, and for the stones we mined to serve as our tombstones. That's right. I can remember it so clearly. I remember how the adults used to describe this place. Like it was setting foot in the gaping maw of a monster. But anyway, that's all history now. It is. All the bloodstains on the rocks, the still air, the constant stench of death. We're very lucky that it's all in the distant past. The smell of sweat and debris still hangs in the air. But at least now the Danans of Menencia can live with joy in their hearts. And it's you that we have to thank for this, Lord Dohalim. We would never have come so far if it wasn't for you. Mm. Magal, why bring all of this up now? What exactly is the point? I just wanted to remind us. I think it's important that we remember how precious the rights we enjoy under his lordship's grace truly are. But I still don't get why... You'll understand soon enough. For now, I simply want you to keep what I've said in mind as we continue our journey. Does the game even let me? It does let me. What do you say we check back in on the ranch? That's actually funny. Oh, we can cook. It says Royal Guard. Does that include the normal guards? What do you say we check back in on the ranch? Oh, she, she can make a fish. This looks perfect. Guaranteed to hit the spot. Seems encourageable. Okay. Next most important factor. <laughs> hmm.
Is it next support and then what? Like put that on the other side. strike. Hmm. Alright, so we just need to use her boost attack. This is def- oh, it's attack. against, like, actual casters. That just always downs the enemy. Right, I'm gonna grab a drink. Be right back. Alright. Let's go. Lord, right? Don't you have cash? Can we, can we get some apple gels? Forced encounter so that we can use her shield block. some kind of deterrent not that i know of this is where the spirit vessel is housed so it's no place for beasts what's going on where are all the laborers <sighs> you're the only one who doesn't seem in the least bit surprised perhaps you'd care to enlighten us all in due course my lord but first just a little bit further once we reach our destination everything will become clear soon enough Fine. As you wish. Like this first combat goes, he really just doesn't care. I noticed your shield just appears out of nowhere whenever you need to use it. Just like Shion and her gun. Does it use the same Renin transferal technology too? Don't you need astral energy in order to use that? You do. Obviously, I can't cast arts myself, but I'm equipped with a device that has the necessary energy charged into it. As long as I'm using the device, I can call forth my shield whenever I like. Equipment charged with astral energy isn't all that rare. So basically, there's nothing special about Renin technology that prevents Danins from using it? No. But as you might expect, normally they'd never be given any of it in the first place. It's not as if just anybody gets to have it here. You need to earn Lord Dohalim's trust before you're allowed access to it. What makes you so sure he's not bribing you? Rinwell. I'm just being honest. It's not normal. I can understand why you'd be skeptical. However, Elda Menencia truly has transformed and evolved from the sort of realm it once was. Yes, she's right. And Yo, that's exactly why I... Too. Miguel? Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. 
I'll explain more once we arrive at our destination. This thing hits hard when it charges at wow. you. Tower shield. Granite room. Two at once. Good. really effective, but if it's going to like rely on waiting until it's already airborne to stop it. He was in the air for sure. That doesn't count. material when I see it. Okay. We're all right, Alfin. We use the fan as a shield. All right. I saw the block falling. I didn't know you could use arts like that. Yeah, but still, what's with that smoke and these zoogles around here?
drop rocks into a bench blender and harvest astral energy. I mean, it's clear they're hollowing out the planet. Is what we don't know that they've hollowed out their own planet. That's probably where we're going with this. Oh no. Oh no. What have you done? Use it. Did she manage to get an over limit and then not use it? Look sharp! Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. I guess I'm forced to go. Uh, it's going to be to my right. Their path forward. How long have they been mining this place out? Since before I was born. Or so they tell me. Probably for decades. That long? I'm impressed the place has never caved in during all that time. Linear path just happens to be very squiggly. Ow! If it's in the sky, it's mine. I never miss! Ready to go! Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Glacial Spear! Yeah. Pierce Eagle! Got fire! Do not! I've got this! Let a fire handle it! All yours! I know! One more! Water! Hear my fire! That's my cue! Make it right! Keep it suspended! Flashing back! Whoa, what? Calves of steel? Is that the one for using the leg down attacks? Super Swallow Dance. Uh, what are you working on now? You attack. That's also a tank. Don't get careless. Is there nothing in that? Looks like this is the alternate passageway. Like we got them all. Oh, 
This looks nice and tough. That's opal. I mean, earth resistance would be a good thing to have on in general. Got some of those. I'll wait until I get to an actual metal snip to take a look at what my options are. More. Let's dispose of the trash. Here goes! Healing! Getting Renwell's boost gauge to fill up. I won't rest until I'm the best I can be. Still, pretty cleanly is good. Striving to be on par with the Lord? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. It's on. Like those ones I get are like just the uh, replacement for like the post-battle cutscene. So that's that's fine. Your movement, and I'll stop your life. Enemy no, Mass devastation. I'm on target. Annihilation. Starter. I'm on target. Look sharp. One more. Oh. Tiger blade. Water. Ready. Evil side. Right. You're Water. done. Get toasty. Burn strong. I feel. Sprightlier than before. Nice level. She's sprightlier. And that was all for some elemental attack. And now we can do lots of other things. Is penetration, like, good for her? I'm assuming it is. This one looks like it's going to be fun. And it's attack plus 30. Welcome to hour 19. Barely a blip on our radar.
They respawn. Back over here. So I'm guessing what's his face does have. Master core. I see a plant up there. It'll be a brain. One of the herbs. Get in, get out. Denied. Burning. Watch it. jump to see if I can make the staircase. Oh, hang on a second, let's... I'm doing research for speed tech! Let me j try and jump further down the staircase. Because I wasn't sure if like his foot caught the rail and so it didn't put me over the edge. Blocking me. It's like they give you a jump button, but they don't let you jump over anything. Like, I get it. Peach gels and apple gels. Well, okay. Slinger. I have to be in this world. Don't worry. I've got your back.
Heavy treat's good, man. Heavy treat is good. This place is a lot more complicated than I expected. Is this the right way? Let's dispose of the trash. Practically unstoppable. Practically. Are you on alert for your brother? You needn't worry so much. He's not the type of man to act rashly. Right. I kind of do actually appreciate it. They gave me a dungeon to, uh... To get used to her without having to deal with both of them at once. Nah, this is orange gel time. At this point, a third of my uh, cure points is called 100. All but, anyway. Let's dispose of the trash! Eat her! This one's mine! I feel like this is setting up wind bombs here because I'm like. like slowly setting up for something. Kind of what is the path forward? And I think it actually is to go that way and drop off that ledge. Dragon, 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 Dragon,
Healing. I've been doing really great lately. Let's get this fight in while we still have the meter. The encounter meter. Out of our way! Open with that, so I just need to build all the way back up. This one's mine. Do it. Do it. Take Commander of Heaven. Phoenix Cyclone. Wow, that was a fast fight. Let's keep our eyes on the prize. Say our score for that should be ridiculously high. a door. Looks like we've arrived. This is the way to the medical facility, right? What medical facility? You'll see. Let's keep going. Really worth a cutscene. Combination of Sara and Law is actually pretty strong still. Well, let's just see what happens. Statues? Is an underground lake here. Tell me, where is the medical facility? There is no medical facility. It's not here. In fact, it never even existed in the first place. Uh, but I've seen people carried in here with my own eyes. Where could they have all gone? Oh, without form. The answer is right in front of you. You need but open your eyes. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that they all drowned in this lake? No. They are just what you see before you. What's left when matter ceases to be matter. Perhaps the scale is throwing you off. Let me show you what I'm getting at. What? <laughs> no way. So then, this entire lake is... Yes, all this is the hollowing. I still don't follow, Miguel. What happened to your hand? And what is this hollowing you speak of? This is what I wanted to show you, my lord. 
When a life form's drained of its astral energy, its physical form breaks down completely, a death leaving no physical remains. All that's left is a reflective substance, the only proof that matter once existed at all. That hollowing is the substance that fills this lake. This whole lake? How many people? How many Danans? <laughs> you actually expect me to believe all that? That an astral arts illiterate Danon would know of this unseen atrocity? And that I, a Renan lord, would have no knowledge? And he eats I the fruit? Have. One last piece of evidence, Lord Doalim. This is a fruit of Helgen. The cause of all of this. What are you doing, Miguel? <coughs> Here is your proof, my lord. Proof of the bounds of your knowledge. Proof of the countless Dan and deaths under your watch. No, they were not merely deaths. Those Danans were completely erased. And now, the only testament is that lake of Halloween. They can't really animate this well enough, can they? <laughs> Miguel! Someone close to you is behind all of this. This person is amassing huge amounts of astral energy. You have to stop them. You're the only one who can prevent Menencia from returning to the living hell that it was once before. I beg you, for the future of the utopia you have created, please stop them. Don't let your dream die just as it's become a reality. Wait a minute, I... I don't know if I... Nicole! 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 Forgive me, Kisara. I'm sorry. It was the only way I could open his eyes. I didn't have much time left anyway. Please help our Lord Dohalim to make our greatest dream a reality. Get him under control. Damn. If he wasn't 
already strong enough. Pray forgive me this, my lord. Makes no sense, but sure. We need a boss here, I guess. Be nature. Rock is huge. Watch out, everyone. Their armor is rusted. Not like this. Stay away from my friend. That freaking does it. Eat I hope we can use that tech one. Yo, what's up, Darby? Did I miss? Oh, there's the mouse. Do I have alerts turned off? No, alerts are turned on. Welcome back to the bail cage. We're doing good, Darby, and hope you're doing well as well. I just completely missed that. I don't know if it was the cutscene or whatever, but we, there are dad jokes in here somewhere. This one's dumb. But I, I guess I'm obligated to read it. I, I'm sorry you keep getting the bad dad jokes. What is a good name for a boy with a short haircut? What is a good name for a boy with a short haircut? We're good. Granted, things are still just tiring enough to the point where today became a oh, screw this, and I'm now playing the new one today. Because those boost attacks seem to still just be way too good. What a good idea. Me for a boy with a short haircut. Bob. When you read it, it makes sense. And then it's like, mm. Bob. Let me lower the game sound. It is Bob. That's probably why I didn't hear the alert either. I need items. I need items. Oh, 
Since I upped the difficulty, I've been burning right through those. This This is actually, it's 
been easy to avoid? Yeah. That's the first time it's actually done significant damage. on that. All right? What was that just now? I understand this is a lot for you to take in, but Nigal trusted you. Impossible. I have no such power. <sighs> Truth be told, I never wanted this. I never wanted to be a lord. You said that at dinner the other night. However, competing for a position in the crown contest was required of me, and in the process, I took the life of a dear friend. The life I took and the bloodshed, the hatred that it earned me. It was far more than I could ever bear. But the screams and tears of the slaves, they would reawaken my memories of that day. The memories of my friend's scream and the tears of the one who mourned him. I couldn't take it any longer. I didn't want to remember. So that's it? That's the real reason you freed the Danans? Just so you wouldn't have to listen to their screams? Wait. I mean... So everything you've done... Precisely. It was simply to distance myself from all the pain and death. All for my own selfish ends. I don't know if distancing from it death is a bad everyone thing. happy in the process. Or then that was just an added benefit. Or perhaps I... I truly did believe in those ideals at one point. But living up to them was never my aim. Impossible. Your dream of coexistence? The ideals that you always championed? So you're saying that everything you stood for? You're saying it was all just a self-obsessed lie? Tell me it isn't true, Lord Dohalim. Because... Because my brother... My brother believed in you in your dream! Forgive me. So this... This is who you really are? Get him with the shield again. Stop! Let go! Let me go! Let me go! It's enough, Kisara! Stop! I'll tear him apart! I swear I'll... I'll... Are you trying to ignore your brother's dying wish? He entrusted you with his dream! Just kill me. I'm nothing. I am but a shell of a man now. I'm just a pitiful coward who shrank from his duties. I would only ask that you make it quick. This 
this man? This is the person my brother died for. And for what? For what? I need you to get out of my sight right now. Go, before I change my mind. Are you feeling any better? Yeah, a little. Thanks. What are we gonna do now? I still have unfinished business with Dohalim. He's a world away from the Lord Balsef was. There's no need for us to fight him, Shion. In case you've forgotten, I Guys, don't... guys! I think something's going on outside. There you are! What's happening? Kelvillik has started an insurrection. He's driving all of the Danans out of the palace. What? Has he lost his mind? What about Lord Dohalim? We don't know where he is, Captain. We thought... We thought maybe you would. No, I don't. I haven't seen him since we were inside the quarry. Damn. Well, either way, I wouldn't go near the palace. Any suspected Renan sympathizers are being arrested on sight. This whole thing is a powder keg about to explode. Best prepare for the worst. Okay. So wait, Renan sympathizers? I guess not all of the Renans here like the idea of coexisting with the Danans after all. So this is it. This is the real Menencia. This isn't. Are you giving up? Bad. On what? This realm is already finished. It perished along with my brother's dream. That's a shame. And I guess all the people who believed in that dream are on their own out there, aren't they? Not all of the Renan sided with Kelzalik. There's still hope, Kisara. Your brother's dream is only dead when there's nobody left who believes in it. Am I wrong? You're right. I'm going to the palace. I need to see what's happening there with my own eyes. <sighs> what are you all doing? Lucy, I thought it was pretty clear. We're coming with you. I appreciate the thought, really. But there's no need for you all to get involved in this. Tohalim said it himself, right? All of us, we're liberators. Thank you. Will things be okay in the city? I'm concerned about that as well. But for now, let us get to the palace. Right. We best clamp down on things at the source before they get out of control. The fact the enemy's holding themselves up tells me they're not exactly happy to see us. Then 
Got to we have to stop text. Sir Kelzalik. Don't you think it's about time you dropped the Sir? Mm. <sighs> he always treated us Danans with such warmth and kindness. Did he have such bad intentions all along? I... I just can't bring myself to believe it. Forget about intentions. We should assume he's the one who's behind all these incidents. It's not surprising to me that there are Renans and Men and Sia who resent Dohalim. But I didn't expect one would be so close to him. <laughs> yes, I suppose you're right. I guess all of us here in Men and Sia are still some way off from being a truly united realm, aren't we? Are you going to be okay, Kisara? I don't know, but I definitely don't want things to end like this. Please, lend me your strength. Of course. Anyone who tries to oppress others is our enemy, and we'll gladly stand against them. Besides, I want to believe that this realm really can do better, too. Mega bones in the It's true, I don't know if you have any dark things. Have you guys checked your equipment lately? To cook more things. Thanks for waiting. Eat as much as you like. I do like when the games at least have like a person who's standing there with the title of medic or something to lend some credence to I'm going to sleep at the inn in the middle of the crisis. Keeping a low profile. Meaning the rebels are occupying the palace? 
Let's hurry up and kick those bastards out. Should we return to the site of dinner? Well, it's been a few days. This place is awfully quiet for a siege palace. Such a huge place is spooky without all those people here. They're probably waiting to ambush us. With so few Renans here, I guess this is what it's like when the Danans are expelled and the ruling minority are all that's left. My money's on them using Zoogles to even the odds. I don't even see any Danan guardsmen. The fact that they're not at their stations tells me they really have been driven out. We all swore an oath of loyalty to Lord Dohalim. My fellow guards wouldn't abandon their post lightly. Speaking of which, where the heck is he? How could this be happening? Any idea where we should go in the main building? Let's try the Lord's Chamber. Worth a shot. I suspect What's-His-Face has taken the cord. From what I hear, that thing can stop even a cannonball. On second thought, let's see if there's a release mechanism somewhere. Wow! Kisara, do you have any idea just what Kelzalik might be planning at the palace? It's hard to say. I've never seen him use any powerful arts. And I don't think he's particularly skilled with any weapons either. However... I have noticed him accompanied by something strange from time to time. What kind of strange? I don't know. I couldn't see anything with him, but I could sense something was there. Probably some sort of zoogle. An invisible zoogle? We'd better be careful in any case. I'd rather we not find out after it jumps us and tries to rip our throats out. Down the middle on the right. Gotta break through. I see one, eh? Here I come. You're finished. That's freaking good. Sure, why? Like sometimes like, this should come in handy it. when crafting weapons. And other times it only hits the one. Seriously, is this a joke? 
Done here. Let's move. Let's. Let's try this way. I'm right behind you, Shion. I think this is a key to the noble room of the castle. A noble what? The room at the northern end of this floor. Maybe the release mechanism is in there. It makes sense we would know which room is where because, well, we have a guard. She works here, so. I don't want to see what's in the guard room. Right. Hmm. <laughs> right. Illustrated guide to shields. <laughs> Is there another garden? Doesn't matter for one fight. Neither are you. No choice. No burn. Burn. Go for it! Prepare to crumble! Oh! Now! You're mine! Now! Kisara! Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Cyclone! I like that one. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right. There are enemy forces here, too? They must be predicting our movements and deploying accordingly. So they figured we were coming all along, is that it? Or short. set of things to go work towards anyway. Done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, she Wait a minute. I have 15 peach gel. I'm I'm not gonna complain. God. Although I do stand by if there's ever a point where uh you're getting items that just don't fit in inventory, you should almost always be given the option to use them immediately. Think about it. This palace is way too big for its own good. Tell me about it. Plus, where the hell were these soldiers and Zoogles all this time? Normally, the Zoogles are kept in specialized training facilities and only get let out in cases of emergency. Like this one, for instance? Give me a break. Okay, resistance. It's two. She, does she have four? This one's still not done. Take down the assassin! Hey, Hold on! Dragon 4! 
Shield or my armor. Treasury key. So what is Mahogsar exactly? One of the five realms of Dana. From the sound of it, Kelzalik had some dealings with them. Probably don't grow anything. Oh, this is the exit. something and nothing. There's something in the chair. There's nothing in the box. I guess that's the surprise. Elemental defense. Mm. Dining hall, that's true. Does it might need a piece gel. Conference room. Hi. Bring them down! Not on my watch! 
Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Xion. Key. Is that some kind of note the rebels left? Hey, it mentions the release mechanism we're looking for, but this isn't enough to go on. Treasury is the last room. I think we got a treasury key, though. Hi. Get lost! You're mine! Hold my it's sword! I'll smash you! Uh, my shield! Uh, this one's mine! Uh, 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 where you did! Damn it, man! Eat it! This one deals as much damage as I can. And I'll stop your life. I like that stalagmite into kick. Everyone still in one piece? Yep. I barely worked up a sweat. Hi. Four. More artifacts. Not the merchant. Now you'll be the wrong side! 
people really don't give up, do they? Now! Look more! I'll stop your movement! And I'll stop your life! Here's a healing arm! Not a chance! Its armor's too strong! Split it open! Be, Be my guest! Up. Here I come! You're finished! Oh, oh, that's it! Oh, oh, that's it! Oh, You're finished! Anything in armor is all mine! Light at the Do it! it. it. Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Cyclone! Hey, I'm pretty lucky. Little help! I don't know where those downstairs is. You got it! I'm still in one piece? Yep. I barely worked up a sw What? I'm starting to think it was in the office after all. I look around the whole like rotunda. More peach chips.
And the office key went to the garden. Another note from the rebels. If we combine it with the note we found before, then there should be a key inside a cabinet in the office. Great. Okay, that's kind of dumb. Like we were in the Let's office, see if we can presumably searching it. Find it. That's awesome that none of them noticed this. Even if Danons and Renans aren't on completely equal footing here, both sides still cared about each other. And now we have to fight some of those same Renans inside the palace. Don't forget, we're here fighting to keep what makes this realm so special alive. Don't lose... Fight all five of them. Right, here goes. Oh, 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 now you see what I can do. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, I never miss. Oh, 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 That's what I want to see. This ends now. Five of them being blasted all at once. What are we gonna call this one? Frozen Hammer. What's it gonna be? Frozen Hammer. I can feel my power growing. Get rid of the wall? To think they would hide it in Lord Dohalim's personal quarters. The nerve of these people. They won't get away with it for much longer. That's right. We have to hurry to the Lord's chamber. Let's go. It says unfamiliar instruments, but it's clearly a violin of some sort.
Well, well, if it isn't the slaves and the traitor, I don't remember giving you permission to enter the palace. So it's true. You really are the one behind all this, Kelzalik. You dropped the sir. I don't remember giving you permission to speak either. Know your place, slave. Now we see his true colors. You saw them at the mine. Yeah, a despicable excuse for a human being. Though really, I guess that makes him pretty ordinary, huh? Yeah. Kelzalik, you were Lord Dohalim's most trusted advisor. His closest ally. Why would you betray him? Don't be a fool. I didn't serve him because I wanted to. I expect a mere slave would not know, but there are many powerful contenders for the position of Lord. A contest of strength determines the one who will be Lord and undisputed ruler oh, of the so realm. Was your son, there wasn't is it? no choice in the selection. If my master had any ambitions of becoming the sovereign, I would have gladly served him. But he had no intention of fighting for the crown. Indeed. Can you slaves even imagine how that looked to the rest of us? Enduring the whims of an ambitionless lord, all we could do was wait for the end as we suffered through our humiliation. You want suffering? Try being Danon for a day. So you plotted against Lord Dohalim in secret. And when my brother found out... It's a weird pupil. And I would do it all coloring. again if it meant returning Menancia to its rightful state! A realm where Danons are slaves and Renans their masters. It's the natural order. It's Enough! Who are you to decide what is natural or rightful, traitor? Miguel. My brother. He dreamed of building a world free of suffering. He gave his life for that dream. And all you've managed to build is a lake of death. You. You killed my brother. And now you'll die Prepare to die. For it. Does he have six fingers? Remember what the gun boss was. That's the video of the game. Again. Veno, huh? My brother's dead because of you. Why should I concern myself with the passing of one pathetic slave? Have you no shame? Be careful. He has some kind of camouflage. Smash you! Where is the weak point? Thunder Oh, that's it. Tiger I'm not it vanished again? Listen carefully and keep your eyes peeled. You're finished! Tiger Blade! Here I come! Dragon Swarm! I can carve through armor! Tiger Blade! Healing Circle! I owe you one! Here! One more! Don't be me! I'm out of ammo! I'm all stuffed up! I'll be finished already! The camera really just doesn't know what to do. I'm not touching the camera button at all. It's just spinning on its own. Tiger We're into his second quarter of its health. Come on! 
I'm still not doing like a ton of damage per hit. It appears to be enough. This out now. I owe you one for that. Whoa. I owe you one. You're mine. It's over. Shell out now. It's 
These slaves are despicable. We we build we beat up your iguana. Your dreams of attaining lordship are no more. Give up, Kelzalek. Attaining lordship? <laughs> Ridiculous. Only those who possess a master core can become a lord. <laughs> what did you think just anyone could do it? But then, what were you trying to accomplish with this? Didn't you betray your lord? Yes, that's true. However, there are other lords. Other lords? So you mean... Where have you been? And why is that the only knife sprite? At last, the truth is revealed. Doholi, where have you been this whole time? Cleaning up. Kelzalek, you've made your last of these. The fruit of Helgen? It can't be. You found my production facility? Correct. And I tore it down. But something still troubles me. It's clear that this is no ordinary fruit. Nor was the equipment used to grow it. You couldn't have done all this without outside assistance. Indeed. Something like this must have come from another realm. Sar, perhaps? You actually expect me to talk now? You don't have to, apparently. At this point, the contest for the crowd will be over soon enough. And you will finally receive the punishment you deserve for your weakness. I've already received my punishment. <laughs> May this be my final act, as the Lord of Elder Men and Sia. <laughs> Go. To Mahagsar, Ganeth Horrors, wherever you think you'll find a suitable lord. <laughs> Really? You're too nice. Now we're going to fight him in the end game. Are you all right with this? He killed your brother after all. He did. But then I thought, he's nothing more than one common ordinary Renan. He's not worthy of my time or my anger, right? <sighs> so after everything, was the dream of coexisting just a dream? No. What is that? Those are the cheers of the brave Danans who overpowered Kelzalik's forces. Wait, they challenged the Renans? Indeed. Oh, yeah. A militia made up of Danan guardsmen, Renan supporters, and of course, the gold dust cats. Do we have you to thank for bringing them all together? Kind of. Regardless of what your original motivations were, your dream of coexistence saved countless lives. And now, those people out there are fighting to keep that dream alive. That's something real. Be that as it may, they do so now by their own hands. These people no longer need any lord. Go outside and resign. It'd be cool. Where are you going? To put an end to the crown contest. Hmm. So long as its madness persists, peace will remain ever out of reach. I cannot allow it to continue. The crown contest impacts far more than just the Danans. 
You're choosing to fight Lenegas and the entire Empire. I am well aware. However, if I wish to keep this dream from dying, then I have little choice in the matter. Besides, it's the least I can do. So, you're gonna go out there and make that dream real on your own? You may be decided on your path, but that doesn't make it any less difficult. Why not walk that road with us? Pardon? You heard me. We're fighting to liberate the Danans. You're fighting for the people of this realm. I'd say we're on the same path, really. It would only make sense for us to walk it together. Danon dissidents, side by side with a Renan lord? Yeah, sure, why not? Not the least intriguing invitation I've received. An invitation which would only be proper courtesy for me to accept. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Hey, where'd Kisara go? I don't see her anywhere. Maybe she just needed some time alone. A lot's happened. That makes sense. She did just lose her brother after all. <sighs> we ought to keep moving as well. So long as there are lords who draw breath, we have a mission to complete. All right, what's Kisara's your mission? Kisara's a big girl. I'm sure she can handle herself. We should hurry on ahead to our next destination. I guess you're right. And it is a lot safer here than it was. What do you think, Dohalim? I am not sure I have the right to say anything as far as Kisara is concerned. Fair enough. Well, I, for one, would like to say goodbye if we get a chance. Let's keep an eye out for her as we leave. Orb! As I said it last time. Got fondue. Is penetration your ability to break attacks? What's Kisara going to do now? I'm sure it's complicated for her. Where did Kisara run off to? You don't think she took off after Kelsalik, do you? No. Nagal entrusted her with his dream. She wouldn't do something reckless like that. Right now, I think she just needs time to think. What she does from here on out is up to her. She has to be the one to decide. Hmm. Sunglasses always look good. Can't even see the tails. For an accessory, it's the plaque shaft, or it's the polk shaft. It's been a while since I've made one.
almost undoubtedly outside, but if she's not, I'll go back to the guard's quarters. I'll... It's one screen. It's the same screen, so I'll go as far as the gate to the next area. here from Cislodia, yes? In that case, you should depart via the south gate, rather than the one you arrived through. And she'll just have to live with not being here while we go shopping. Check your equipment with it. Hmm. on the one I currently have. Extra defense. Fire damage is actually not terrible for me, but the num amount of damage we're doing is so low and the amount of times I actually use the fire abilities is not frequent enough. We're talking seven hit points every time I use a fire attack. Accessory is only worth two. Oh my goodness. something do this
like to check their wares if you don't. Let's try this. After all that, Kisara never came back to see us. I'm surprised she slipped away without us noticing. Where would she even go? I hope this place survives. You think the Danins and Renans have a chance of getting along? We didn't really do much to change things around here, did we? This realm had its own walls to overcome. And in the end, it was the people themselves who decided to break them down. They without any help, help from us. I hope they, they keep going. Good. I really do. Yeah, well, if you say so, I guess. Huh? All right. I leave command of the gold dust cats in your hands. You've got nothing to worry about, Kisara. I'll do your brother proud. I was really hoping she was leaving the cat in charge. Looks like it's time to go. Take good care of Zare for me. All right, Lagil? You've got it. Stay safe, Kisara. She had a cutscene. Did you come to say goodbye? Actually, I was wondering if you could use another companion. Huh? Well, we certainly don't mind you coming along. We just figured you'd stay behind and help rebuild. These people could use you. I thought much the same thing. However, in the end, something changed my mind. Ever since Miguel died, I've been thinking a lot. About where I went wrong, what I should have done differently. You know, that sort of thing. It's true that our dream of coexistence so saved many Danon lives, but we were naive and short-sighted. I was so wrapped up in my idea of how things should be that I didn't see the problems that existed right in front of us. I thought we had been given a utopia. And so I never bothered to look too far past its surface. I chose to be ignorant. And because of that, because of me, my brother. Magal's death wasn't your fault, Kisara. Perhaps you're right. But in the end, it was me he entrusted this dream to. I learned that nothing in this life is free. Or gained without sacrifice. Now that I know that, I'll just have to figure out what else I don't know. So, decided to join us? 
I have. And hopefully I can continue to protect Elda Menencia from outside the dream world, for the sake of those still inside. And here I thought you joined for an opportunity on my life. <laughs> In all honesty, I'm grateful to you. I truly am. I don't blame you for what happened. But I must also leave your service. No longer will I be defined by protecting a Renan Lord. From now on, when I fight, I fight to protect my dream. All I ask is that you do your part. That you fight alongside me. Not just for those who used to believe in your dream, but for those that still do. Dohalim. I understand. I'm no longer a lord anyway. Well, this crew just gets bigger and bigger. All right, where to, team? We make for Mahag Sar, the Valley of the Four Winds. Noki! Mm. Leaf wrapped fish. What are we getting all these recipes for? The gang's all here. Got a double jump. That's right, because that's the last one. Then. That's gonna give you that. You need 15 skill points. Lionheart. I could basically pick one of these and line it up. Defense, resistance, defense, and elemental defense. Negative gate is too good. So we're and we're getting the boost. I'm amazed how easily you can move such a giant shield around like it's nothing. Really? It's not actually as heavy as it looks. It's really reassuring to have someone like you protecting us, though. You know, I guess I never realized it before. But looking back, I've always been the sort to put myself in harm's way to protect those around me, even before I joined the Elderman and Sia Guard. So, in a way, Using this shield to keep you all safe feels like it's what I was meant to do. You don't need to worry about protecting me. I don't plan on relying on you. That's okay. It doesn't matter if you do or not. I don't protect people because they ask me to. I do it because I want to, and because I think it's the right thing to do. That goes for you too, Dohalim. Me? Yes. You see, you and I both want the same thing. We have the same goal. That means it's in my best interest to continue to protect and keep you safe as well. Even now. <sighs> I'm not sure how much protecting I'll need either, but I appreciate the thought. I'm sure you'll do us proud, Kisara. Right. You can all count on me. What was Kalzalek even after in the end? Isn't it obvious? Clearly he wanted the throne for himself, and was gonna have his goons execute Dohalim to get it. 
He had to have known he couldn't hope to defeat a lord. He should have run while he had the chance, instead of holing himself up in the palace. Maybe he thought he couldn't run? Either way, the outcome's the same. So he got desperate and decided to go for broke? One might argue that he was another victim of mine, in a sense. Huh? There is no greater calling in life to a Renan than the crown contest, yet I refused to take part. The shock he felt at that must have been truly immense. Enough to drive him to revolt. Even though doing so meant defying Renan hierarchy. I know I've said this before, but Danans and Renans wouldn't coexist here if it wasn't for your stance. But that was no lofty idealism on my part, nor do I feel any pride at what occurred. Spare us the pity party. You literally just joined us to uphold those ideals. Shion! No, she is absolutely correct. I shall speak no more of my misgivings. <laughs> I did want to check. You have no accessory. You've had no accessory this whole time. Um, there. Defense is your shtick. Um, I don't like the halo. There. Hopefully, we get more interesting clothes. Four out of the five realms that I've visited now. I wonder what kind of lord we're gonna find. Well, we haven't been there yet, so don't say now just yet. Wow. Look what I just found. So some questions. We're getting red stat boosters now. This thing. Thought it'd be weird. 
Hey, look at that party. Leg strike. You gotta remember that's his only one of those. Ends of the leg strike. Rolling snap is a leg strike. I should save after all that. Good stat to work towards. His defense actually. Hmm. Wouldn't be a bad thing to build up.
You saw it too. You heard too. Right? Oh, she's the fisher. I didn't realize there was a pond here. You just got here yeah, for the first time in your life. This is Taka Pond, and it happened to have saved my life once upon a time. What do you mean? As a kid, I survived life under the past lords by escaping here when I needed to. It's terrible to swim in, but great for catching a bite for dinner away from Ren and eyes. Bear in mind, our rations back then weren't enough to live off of. You had to take matters into your own hands if you wanted enough food to survive. But how did you catch them? With your bare hands? That might take a while. Fish are prone to swim away at the first sign of trouble. I'd put bait or a lure on a line and use it with a fishing rod. You must not be familiar with fishing if this sounds new to you. Here, let me show you how it's done. Hey, what do you think about that spot? Good idea. I'll go for that one. <laughs> yeah! we go. I'll catch something bigger next time. Looks like a pretty energetic fish. We, we got a fish. So we don't cook the bass, we, we sell the bass. There we go. Good fishers always keep their cool. I don't know how the game works yet. There we go. Get you next time. All right. I'll catch something bigger next time. Nice work! One more. I've got a good feeling about this one. Tag 
Nab it. It got away. That was a good one. Okay. We'll work on that more later, but I think that was the good one. And that's all there is to it. You caught two out of five. Wow. It seems like you need to have good reflexes to catch anything. I don't know if it's really for me. Kisara, I think I've seen enough. Oh, oh, sorry. I guess I'm just in my own little world when I go fishing. Looks like we're going to be here for a while. That's how fishing goes. You wait for a <laughs> bite, and then the real battle begins. Magal told me that different fish live in different regions, and you have to pick the right rod and lure for what you're hoping to catch. But that doesn't change the fact it's a giant time sink. Of course, each fish has its own unique flavor, too. And some mm. of them are supposed to be extremely delicious. Right. When you put stomach. it like that, maybe it's worth me trying my hand at fishing after all. You're just in it for the food. <laughs> I was hoping we'd get to fish during our travels. And it just so happens I made sure to grab my brother's old rod before I left Vicente. Is that what you so, just used? if you ever feel like fishing when we've got a little downtime, just let me know. Good to hear. Thanks for showing us. Okay! Where did you come from? That's a good one to have. Excuse me. This is good to have the skin for that, I guess. Always amazed what healing arts can do. Just do. <sighs> hey. Hmm? What are we doing? Is it just me, or have those two barely spoken a single word to one another? I know, right? But after everything that happened with Magal, is it really any wonder? Kind of puts a damper on the whole journey, though, huh? How long do you think they're gonna keep this up? If it bothers you that much, why don't you ask them? Why do I have to ask? How come you walk together like that? Uh, she really doesn't beat around the bush. You mean Kisara and myself? You hadn't noticed? You've been practically joined at the hip ever since we left Vicente. I guess it's force of habit, most likely. I was always ready to protect him, should the need arise. It sort of came with the job description. Right. From being in the Elder Menencia Guard. Although, Dohalim's pretty capable of defending himself, isn't he? Having guards doesn't necessarily mean the one being guarded is weak. No one's perfect all the time. Even so, it's not like they're entirely wrong, Kisara. You're no longer in my employ, after all. I don't know. I mean, if it's what she's used to and you're both comfortable with it, then who are we to judge? But she doesn't serve him anymore. It isn't normal for her to keep following him around like she still does. You know, she's probably right. 
and a lot has changed over the last few days. I guess it wouldn't hurt to rethink our relationship in light of the new circumstances. Perhaps I'll give it some thought, after all. Does that sound all right by you? Hm. Of course. You might want to stop asking his permission for every little thing while you're at it. <laughs> Sorry. It's not that easy, shaking off old habits. I'll probably need a little time to get fully used to it. I've noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you and try to dodge our attacks at the last second. I hate those guys. I can get some hits in when they move in to attack, Demo's but otherwise they slip past damn near everything else I throw at them. If what you're seeking is a way to more reliably hit them, there is a solution. Try to outclass them on reflexes? I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some extent. They emerge as the land itself and take root on my command. They will swiftly bind the enemies, at which point you can dispatch them. Huh? Uh, what he, he means he is that he can make plants grow to hold the enemies in place. At least I think that's probably what he's saying. I'm glad at least one of us understands him. So basically, if we find an enemy that likes to dodge, we should let Doholim handle it. I shall do what I can within my modest means to help. You raise a horse. So. I mean, what are we going to do with the horse? Oh, boy. I'm going to need to figure out the money situation soon. We can make that. We can't make the others. We need 1920. Second edition. Shield at nineteen twenty. Have you guys checked your equipment lately? Why are you looking at me like that? That armor you wear is standard issue for the Menensean Guard, right? Originally, I've added some flair to it in a lot of places. Huh. I noticed, especially with that open back. Yeah, seriously. We guardsmen pride ourselves on never showing our back to our enemies. It's my way of making myself live up to that. It's, um... Plus, it makes it that much lighter and easier to maintain. Hmm. Dohalim, do you have anything to say about this? Every guardsman is allowed to wear their armor as they see fit. And you, Law? Huh? Why are you asking me? <laughs> I need her to cook things. Thanks for waiting. Eat as much as you like. Oh, 
Oh, man. Mind if I join you, Law? Hmm? Oh, hey, Alfin. What's up? Nothing. I was just surprised to see you weren't training for once. Got a stomachache or something? Uh, you know I don't literally train around the clock, right? I do take breaks. Liar. Do you? It seems like you're training every chance you get. Well, yeah. It can't be helped if I want to get stronger. Still, it's important to let your muscles rest every now and then. That's what my dad told me anyway. Zephyr said that? When I was a little kid, yeah. I would get so excited whenever he came home. I always followed him wherever he went and tried to learn as much from him as I could. He said, it's good to be passionate, but don't overdo it. Just like there are times when you want to take a break from studying, sometimes your body wants to take a break from training, too. I was always rushing around and forgetting to rest, so he ended up telling me that a lot. <laughs> that definitely sounds like him. It's nothing to get sad over. Still... I can't help but wonder if that was my dad's way of teaching me the dangers of rushing into things too quickly. Then again, maybe I'm just overthinking things. I wish I'd had more time to talk to him about this kind of stuff. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. It's weird coming out of the demo. You know these are the playable characters every time you meet them. I feel pretty refreshed after that sleep. All right, we're going to save right here. And I need to eat lunch because I've apparently been doing this for about four hours. <laughs>